Hey guys, um, good morning. I uh, hope everyone is doing well. Um, so guess what? I am back here in the Blue Mountains area again. Um, today I started off at um, Springwood Station. And yeah, uh, definitely a different walk. Even though I've just started, um, as you can probably already tell that this trail here, or this part of the Blue Mountains is um, not as affected by the bushfires, um, which is great to see. Um, but it was raining throughout the week though, so the trail here is absolutely muddy and awfully slippery. Um, I've slipped um, while f I've almost slipped while filming uh, the same number of times I came across a waterfall here. <laughs> Uh, so yeah, I'm feeling absolutely stoked already uh, and I hope you enjoy the rest of the video. I actually climbed all the way up here for this lookout um, but this is not where I'm gonna camp I'm actually gonna head back down um, to where the creek was and camp somewhere around the creek hopefully I get a nice spot I probably won't be coming back up here tomorrow this is just a I guess a site where you gotta stop so here it is So yeah, I guess I've got to um, where I want to get to, to camp tonight. Um, so basically this is the area, I just got to pick a spot. Um, but looks like I've got the place to myself entirely for now. Um, but still it's an hour before sundown, so who knows, someone might come by. But anyway, it's, it's still good either way.
guys, so that's day one done and dusted. It's about 10 now, um, and I'm ready for bed. So yeah, uh, long story short, there was no campfire for tonight, so that was quite a bummer. But anyway, I uh, met this lovely English couple, Sam and Hannah. I'll probably leave their photos here. Um, but they were so nice, they came over to help me with my fire. Um, but sadly, we all failed. Um, everything was just too wet and also because sand retains moisture and because it was raining the whole week so um, yeah we couldn't keep the fire going but anyway we had dinner together um, they invited me over we, we each cooked up our own dinners and um, <laughs> it was so great because it was like a uh, an express cultural exchange um, over the three hour dinner that we had um, at their campsite um, talked about uh, like a bit of the Malaysian history the British colonization we talked about the royal families in Malaysia and in, in the UK um, random stuff like the Harry Potter Lord of the Rings um, and the English football Premier Leagues things like that so yeah it was great fun um, Anyway, uh, I won't keep this too long. So day one was definitely good. Um, this trail was definitely a lot more enjoyable because, well, simply because it was shorter. I had a lighter pack and it was along a creek uh, with a few very beautiful waterfalls. Um, so yeah, today was good fun. Mm, I'll probably leave it here. And I'll check in with you guys nice and early tomorrow morning. Um, so I guess that's that. I'm all packed up now um, and ready to head back out. Uh, I guess I won't be filming as much today because well, my camera battery died um, early this morning so I didn't get to really <laughs> film as much of this with my DSLR. Um, did it mainly on my iPhone. Um, 
Anyway, this was such a great camping spot, like just by the waters, um, uh, and you can hear the rapids a little upstream. And, and waking up to this with this view, uh, it was just spectacular. Um, wouldn't mind coming back to be honest. Um, so we'll see, we'll see how that goes. Anyway, um, I might uh, leave the video here. Um, so I hope you enjoyed the video. Um, and yeah, um, stay well. <laughs> Take care. it out. I'm so disappointed that my camera ran out of battery um, so I could only shoot on my iPhone. I guess I gotta learn from this lesson and probably invest in another battery pack. Um, so yeah, absolutely gorgeous. 